Hello, everybody. Welcome to part three of Delta Rune. With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. And indeed, we have reached the portion of the video where I am completely in the wilderness. Uh, parts one and two was all the stuff I played yesterday when the when the game uh, first became available. And then this is the point where I realized this was something worth uh, playing with all of you. So now you get to join me for the rest of this adventure, for however long it may last. Alright. Let's see where we... Let's see what there is to see. <laughs> the feel of hopes and dreams. Enemies ahead. You're gonna die. Signed, Lancer. <laughs> A whole new world. A new fantastic point of view. Whoop. We've got... Paper Mario style enemies. Rudin drew near. Rudin. Whoops. Oh, sh... I... Almost attacked. I, I keep doing that where I, like, defaults to attack, so I accidentally attack. Well... Let's check it. And then once I can just defend. Rudin. Attack 6. Defense 0. This ambivalent diamond isn't any girl's best friend. I'm just a normal person. Whoop. So first... So first we were dodging sp spades. Now we're dodging diamonds. I'm not looking for a moy rail either. Rudin. Rudin thinks about elaborate stones. Well, let's convince him. <laughs> you told Rudin to quit, quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Smells like jewelry. Chris spared Rudin. You won! Got zero XP and, uh, 42 dollars. Yay! Friendship achieved. Dodgy relationships? I thought this wasn't the friend sim. Yep. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. <laughs> Not really. Signed Lancer. Don't read this sign yet. It's a work in progress. Sign Lancer. Ho ho ho! If it isn't my two favorite people. Psych! You guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? What? You mean the purple girl? Ho ho ho! You fools! You're too late to stop me. What did you do? Ha ha ha! It was so simple! She beat me up, so I ran away. <laughs> That's a bit anticlimactic. <laughs> These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Whatever you do, don't check the tree, and use C to open your menu. <laughs> You got it? Signed Lancer. Uh-huh. Very... But such a cunning, a cunning, uh, sign, Lancer. There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one? Sure. You got the dark candy. I'm gonna leave the second dark candy because I'm a baller who won't need it. And also because I remember the candy bowl from the first game, and it's polite to always... To only... It's polite to only take one. After, I mean, we're not savages here. Hey, if you head that way, my troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? 
I prefer to think of it as an invitation. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm taking it as an invitation. You better believe that. Oop, oop. A, a necklace of Rudin's uh, blocks your path. Lectured the enemy, the enemies, on the importance of kindness. The enemies became tired. You're like, what? Okay, shine, shine, shine. Okay, so now we're going to. I'm going to convince that one. I'm going to pacify the first one. Told Rudin to quit fighting, it was utterly swayed. Well, Sayakas passed by. <laughs> I guess that makes sense. Besides, uh, Chris spared Rudin. You won! 0 XP and 61 D Ds. Hello. Interesting. Mamma Mimba, I'm Top Chef. My latest cake worked me to exhaustion. <laughs> so I took a little nap. But Mamma Mimba, uh, a scary noise woke me up. A beast was hunched on the table, eating the cake like an animal. I spritzed it with water and it hissed and ran off. But my beautiful cake, oh my god, was that Susie? <laughs> Top Shelf just spritz Susie to get her away from the cake. Oh. Aw, Chris, that sounds like Susie. We must be going the right way. Okay, I... There, There has got to be... If there isn't already, there has got to be fan art of Susie getting spritzed off the table away from the cake. I demand to see this fan art immediately. Let's try to keep her... Let's try to keep her out of any more trouble. It's smoking for some reason. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. <laughs> Why? How? Take a piece? Yeah, sure. The broken cake was added to your key items. Oh, interesting. Maybe, is that going to be how we uh, convince Susie to join us? Fighting, it was utterly swayed. Else I spared with it, with it. Um, okay. Uh, uh, oh, oh, <laughs> okay, so that's what happened. Heffy smile, the daring smile. I wonder if there's a. Uh, somebody wonders if. I wonder if there's a way to uh, switch up the order your, uh, your characters take actions. Because, like, I can imagine scenarios where it would be more convenient to have uh, Rasai use his magic before Chris does whatever he does, or whatever they do. Uh, let's check him out. Letter X. Okay. Happy smile with dance one. Um, just gonna defend for now. Happy attack seven, defense zero. I am a little kiss. Kiss with a mouth. Okay, there we go. Athy's whispering a lovely spell. That's alarming. Excellent. I am absolutely going to flatter the fluffy boy. Oh, you ordered a sock? Well, we'll see to flatter all the enemies. Interesting. <laughs> I'm making tea later. Would you like any? Oh, so that's how that works. Okay. So we can flatter him ourselves. 
them ourselves, or we can order our party members to do it. That's interesting. Chris spared half the I like that little animation, of the, the little spare animation. You won. Zero XP and 65 Bs. Fashion block puzzle. Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you'll need to hurry. Okay, I see what I see what the deal was there. I think. If there's a this might be like a I'm just checking for hidden paths because those happen sometimes the maze of death okay so it's just the maze never mind then behold the maze of death prepare to get lost clowns signed the lancer Feeling lost yet? You must be utterly helpless among these twists and turns. You haven't even had a fork in the road yet. Idiot. Your sense of direction won't save you now. Signed, Lancer. What's this? Some sort of enemy. Looks like they got clobbered. Uh, Susie's been here. Hey, wait. Where am I? <laughs> help! <laughs> Somebody help! I'm lost! Sign Lancer. <laughs> Lancer really is the new papyrus. You open the treasure chest. Inside was a right ribbon. You, pr you put right, right ribbon in your armors. Interesting. That ribbon is armor, Chris. It increases defense. Why don't you try wearing it in the equipment menu? I think it'd look great on you. Increases cuteness. And defense. Uh, Dina. I was kind of hoping it would uh, be visible on the character. I always That's always a nice touch. That's unfortunately fairly rare in, like, JRPGs is visible equipment. Let's see. Whoa! whoa wait a minute! Even if you're my enemy, I've got to warn you. A purple beast is roaming, clobbering everyone who dares block her way. So, we, we don't even like fighting. The, the king left us no choice. King, you say? You need to stop Susie, quick. Hmm. So the king is the bad guy, and we're traveling around with the prince. Hmm. Interesting. Very fucking interesting indeed. We're gonna have to fight. We're gonna have to, uh. We're gonna have to strife with, uh, Relsei's dad later, I think. Hey, don't look! This sign's private. <laughs> Sign Lancer. Oh, it's just this way. Sign Lancer? <laughs> Somehow you survived the maze. But don't count your blessings before they hatch. That's not how that expression goes. Let's see how you fare against this team. Three Hathies blocked the path. Oh, whoops. Did it again. to flutter all the enemies. Out of anyone, I'm glad we randomly encountered all of you. <laughs> Aw. It's adorable. Okay. One is willing to be spared. Hey, why are you guys thrashed? You're totally outnumbered. 
You made a team purely of support enemies. Their bullet patterns aren't balanced at all. <laughs> it's like a dinner made out of three glasses of milk. <laughs> Ow! Oh! Oh! <laughs> well, say it with the fatality. And that's, um, unusual somehow? Aww. <laughs> oh, he, he's, he's trying. My answer is trying. <laughs> Why don't we all talk about this after the battle? Alright, um... Okay, well, I'm going to... Oh, and they're all ready to be spared. Spare the happy. Say spare the happy. Great job, Chris. We earned zero XP and ninety-two uh, dollars and ninety-two money. Sweet. How much do I get? <laughs> you, you lost, Lancer. You don't get any? <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> oh. <laughs> I almost feel bad for him. Look at that. Oh, he's so sad. <laughs> Can I have some of yours? Oh! <laughs> Angry fluffy boy. Fine. Later, losers. Ugh. Oh. Sup? I thought you were running away. Yeah, I finished. <laughs> oh. Be angry. Did I succeed? I guess I did succeed. I don't know if I did succeed. I'm gonna try this. I don't think I made it. I'm not sure what I'm hoping to accomplish here, to be honest. Yeah. Am I losing or just not seeing what I have to do? I think we might be missing something. Maybe we should try going to the next room? Okay. Maybe we can only do this puzzle with Susie. Three buttons. Oh, okay, yeah, I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need to do this with Susie. Ah! Open up, you stupid door! Oh, great. It's you guys. Susie? We're... We were ever so worried about you. Um, how'd you get past those spikes before? <laughs> Walk through them. But this door sucks. Aw, don't worry, Susie. It'll open after we solve the puzzle over there. Nice. Tell me when you finish it. Uh, Susie, we need you to finish it. Sometimes proceeding will take all three of us. Furthermore, only Chris can seal the dark fountain. So if you don't accompany us, you won't make it home. <sighs> so you're saying I have to stick with you guys? Yep! <laughs> Let's just get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back on the team! Kill the fanfare! <laughs> Susie! Joined! The party! <laughs> uh. Coming around to Susie. <laughs> uh. 
Susie follows at a distance such that no one can tell. She's associated. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. There we go. Sounds like a door opened. <laughs> oh, Chris, I just realized Susie missed the missed the tutorial. Next battle, we should show her how to act. I think she might really enjoy that. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh, dear. See Brown attacked violently. You recall Rosal's advice to include Susie in, in, in an act. Okay. Next compliment. Interesting. Um... You ordered Susie to flatter the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? It attacked us. Let's smash it before it moves. Uh, look, Susie, it seems it seems harmless. If you act nice, we might win without hurting it. Okay, okay. Hey, little guy. I, uh, I really like the axe in your face. Oh. Where do you get it? <laughs> um, Chris, maybe I should, maybe I should talk to her. You won. Well, at least I only got zero XP, so that didn't, no XP, so that's good. Did Susie get the XP, though? That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried that Susie got that XP. <laughs> I sneaked by and made a sign. Signed Lancer. Nice. All right. Oh, hey, a shop. Um, Susie, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. Eh, she didn't miss. Oh boy. <sighs> As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? <laughs> hmm. Um. Well, if we just took it easy on them. Well, if you just took it easy on them. If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which can put exhausted people to sleep. Yawn. Yeah, talking to you is already doing that. Well, um, just think about it. You might have to warn enemies about her, Chris. Yep, see, it's... I called it. Nice. Seer of Light. Called that a while ago. So this is gonna... So this is going to be, like, part of the puzzle now of doing a pacifist run, is, uh, doing it without letting Susie kill everyone. Hey, kid. You want to buy a tutorial? <laughs> it's only 50 dark dollars. Um... Well, I have no... Well, really? You'll really buy it? I just want to see what will happen. This sounds stupid, but hey, whatever. <laughs> right this way, gentle, gentle nurse. Okay. We're sorry, we're not really puzzle guys, but we've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. When the king got power, he fired everyone and replaced all puzzle makers with him. Ruxus Card, Lord of the Puzzles. Be careful. I'm TP Master. Ask me about TPs. Uh, gaining TP. A secret. What's TP? A secret. Let's see. I know what TP is. It's magic points. Uh, secret. TP only lasts inside a fight. Once you win, it's out of sight. Having extra feels unbearable. No point in saving. It's straight up terrible. The leftover TP turns into extra money at the end of a battle. Oh, that's good to know. You mean I only should have been using one square? Oh, so that's interesting. Good. You gain TP when you defend, protect yourself, uh, then cast spells, friend. 
You also gain the heat by being close to bullets. Look for the heart outline when you get close to bullets. He rhymed bullets with bullets. B because it's important! Okay. I'm Ralph Say Master. Ask me about Rasal's. Uh. Pass part. The Healy. Fact. Ralph Say loves when you give us money. <laughs> he will hug you. Call you money. Call you honey. Hey, that's not true. <laughs> Angry eyebrows. You don't need money to get me to do that. Aww. A good fluffy boy. Um, let's hear about the healing. Because I haven't actually used that spell at all, and I want to know about it. Or I'll say it has a spell that heals, dude. Why use that when you can eat food? Because you won't have to use up an item? I could have avoided all these empty calories. That's all I need. I'm the Susie Master. Ask me about Susie's. Uh, facts. Susie loves when you give us money. She will... Nope. Don't care. Did I say something funny? Ask me about Susie's warning. When Chris uses warning, Susie can't hit. So make sure to... So there's no reason to use it. <laughs> unless... Unless you want it not to hurt. So there's no reason... <laughs> Susie always attacks the foe on top. Good to know. So smash them with a crushing chop. She always strikes at the first thing she sees. Oh no! Oh no, she's looking at me! I'm the Chris Master! Something about Chris is, uh, let's get it as a fact. It's a good idea to give us bucks. It'll make you happy and fill you with lux. Over there is our donation hole. We had a box, but it got stole. Reviving. When HP goes negative, your friends fall down. But bringing them back is easy town. Playing foods and spells work like a charm. And with a mint, you can cure all harm. Even normal items and spell can, spells can revive people, huh? That's good to know. I want a pet rel say, says the people. Uh... That's what I'm saying. Acting. If you only act, you might start to think. What about the guy with the scarf in pink? If you know acting will make the enemy friendly, then you can ask me to spare the spare on the same turn. Or cast pacify if you know they'll get tired. If you plan ahead, a lot can happen in one turn. Indeed. Hey, who's the master here? Me or you? Whole goals. One dollar monthly tutorial weekly. Ten dollars weekly tutorial monthly. What? Ah, uh, one hundred dollars. Stop making tutorials. The king didn't even give us severance pay. His son just gave us all beanies. Itchy beanies. Donation hole. If you like our tutorials, please throw your money into a hole. Yeah, sure. Put a dollar in the hole. The hole became full. So I have the hole is filled to the brim with cash. Alright. That's as much as I can put in. <laughs> Apparently. Hee <Huh>? hee. <laughs> Welcome, tap travelers. <sighs> Item. Let's see. Dark candy. Dark Burger. Amber Card. An offensive Charm. Interesting. A spooky Sword. It's black and orange. <laughs> it's nice, because this game came out on Halloween, so it's, it's kind of perfect. I just noticed that the button eye is moving. It's a little weird. Well, let's see, um... Uh, I'm a pacifist, so I definitely do not need the spooky sword. Uh, but the amber card might be useful. So yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. 
Tick 2. One for Susie, too. What kind of junk you got? Alright, the Glow Shard, it said in the uh, menu earlier that it's only good for 7, so I'm gonna do that. I notice we're not doing the uh, Undertale thing where, like, like, cause that was one of the joke. That was one of the early jokes in Undertale's. Like, you try to sell your junk, and the shopkeepers are like, "What? Why would I want to buy this? This isn't a pawn shop. It's a shop." <laughs> um, so, any weapons to sell? You don't have anything. Yeah, I'm gonna equip those in a second. Turn. What we got to talk about. Let's talk about you. The name Seam, pronounced. Shalm. <laughs> Pronounced Shalm. Alright, Shalm. The name's Shalm. And this is my little sheep. Oh, I, I get it. <laughs> it's a shop. <laughs> Shalm in his shop. Over the years, I've collected odds and ends. Of course, I got no attachment to any of it. Just a hobby of mine. Right here. I just noticed that little doll in the corner, like right uh, right to the left, right below the delta sign. That little doll looks cute. Around here, you learn to find ways to pass the time, or go mad like everyone else. Yeah, let me just see if it was something different. You never know. Lighteners. Interesting. Long ago, the Darkners lived in harmony with the Lighteners. They were like gods to us, our protectors, our creators, those who gave us purpose. Then one day we were all locked away in this prison, and the Lightners never returned. Embittered, the king took up arms and aimed to take revenge upon the Lightners that left us behind. Of course, even among his troops, some still distantly hoped the Lightners would return. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> the kingdom. Historically, this land was ruled by the four kings, from Card Castle to the east. Oh, Andrew, okay. Four kings for... It is the Midnight Crew! <laughs> uh, God damn it. Toby Radiation Fox, you fucking homestuck. <laughs> Historically, this land was ruled by the four kings, from Card Castle to the east. But recently, a strange knight appeared, and three of the kings were locked away. The remaining king put him and his strange son into power. Yeah, so it's the... You're telling me that Jack Noir is the bad guy here? The car motif probably owes more to Carol Lewis than Andrew Rousey. Also possible, but... But now I am... I can't help but imagine, you know, Jack Noir being the big bad guy here. AGAIN! <laughs> this land hasn't seen this much chaos since... <laughs> well, you don't need to know about that. Legendary, just coming out and saying it. <laughs> so you're the heroes who are going to seal our fountain. <laughs> Good luck. It makes no difference to me. Neither light nor dark hold a future for a darkener in my condition. Well. Alright. See you again. Or not. <laughs> Alright, so let's equip some... Let's equip some armor. Whoops. Basic red scarf made of lightly magical fiber. This is defense a bit. And we'll give one to you too. The main axe. Beginner's axe forged from the mane of a dragon whelp. Cool. Thin square charm that sticks to you, increasing defense. It's, it's, like a, it's 
like a sticker. We can practice play with a carbon reinforced core. Okay. Alright. Susie, the Violet Tormentor, is now your ally. The power of Mean Girls. <laughs> The power of Mean Girls shines within you. Uh, what's in here? It's a lone door frame, but for some reason you can't see through it. Interesting. Hey there. Well, flip my flat jackets. The clowns are back in town. Bad news, since you last saw me several minutes ago. The power of fluffy boys and mean girls. That is the engine driving this crazy train. I've created a, bla a brand new fighting team ready to stop you. Not even the purple girl can stop me now. Ho <laughs> ho are you ready to be... Stop, stop talking. Ho ho ho. What is that, why are you saying that? <laughs> It's my evil laugh. Scary, right? You sound like... <laughs> you sound like baby Santa Claus. Uh, you mean like in a badass way? Oh. <laughs> oh. Shut up. Um. You really think you know how to be scary? Well, I... Wrong. Man, why be tough guys like you really piss me off? Face it, you wouldn't know scary. If it picked you up and bit your face off, uh, guys? I want to put a leash on Susie here. That's not true. Aww. Oh, really? Then why don't we prove it? We'll start with the part. Where your face gets bit off. <laughs> oh, okay. I get it. Thank you, Purple Girl. What? Thanks. It was kind of you <laughs> to teach me how to be scary with an evil laugh. <laughs> hey, I, I, I wasn't. And now... You're going to be thrashed. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> I guess that's kind of an improvement. <laughs> A board of jigsawaries blocked the way. Okay, well, we're on the top one. So, I give him a warning. You and Ralph say, warn the enemies about Susie. Everyone went on guard. Flip your dicks, Paula. I need one. Whoa! Hello! Yeah, they have been warned. Uh, the friend! You barely lifted a finger, and... <laughs> Alright, you win! Let's be friends! <laughs> We're friends now, voila! I always want a friend like you. Whoop. Jake's very thought of its boss and felt afraid. Spared him.
probably should have defended there to get a little extra uh, dollars. Still working on maximizing my uh, potential here. Oh, look, Chris, another, another puzzle. Oh, no. Let's read the instructions. Which appear to be broken. Huh? The instructions are vandalized. It says, Faust fools, that will never figure it out now. Ruining instructions? That's definitely against the rules. <laughs> Aw. Then it um, says, P.S. I make my own rules. R.K. Well, that explains that. Why don't we just climb over the spiked fence? Um, because then we get impaled and die? Cool. I'll work on that and you do the puzzles. <laughs> um, try your best, Chris. Don't look at me, Chris. Puzzles are your job. Along with everything else I don't want to do. Alright. What have we got here? Oh, lock puzzle. Okay. Great job, Chris. I think you're onto something. Give up whenever you feel like it. It's all good. Chris, you can't solve it by stepping on the switch. You're in a box. Chris, don't listen to him. You can be a box. <laughs> I was a box for Halloween once. Um, just a box? Well, it's not like I can dress up as a goddamn monster. <laughs> oh. oh, Susie. Chris, good job. Damn, didn't get to didn't get to impale myself. Oh well, come on, chumps. Good job, Crisp. Crisp, Chris. All right, where are we going? All right, looks like the correct way. So let's go this way. Bottom, the order of our rooms is in Car Castle, of course. If you haven't if you haven't been there, you wouldn't know it. Yeah, interesting. Alright. Various guys appeared. Face by Diamond Cutter. Good way to get up, uh, grind up TP. So yeah, we flatter it, and then 
and spare it on the same turn. So Haffy, its teeth looked like knives. It began to think about this. So say spared Haffy. In the hang of this. Under eight dollars. All right. When you step into the light, you'll return to where you were before. Came very close to killing it. Okay, not gonna. Let's see. Uh... I wish the second one good night. Didn't quite pacify the first one. Experimented a little bit with, uh, what, what I was attempting, what I was uh, doing there was experimenting with, uh, letting Susie attack it so that I could, uh, put him to sleep. And it worked, but it also came very close to getting them all killed. <laughs> okay. So I think I'm gonna not do that, just because it's kind of nerve-wracking. So you've begun to, begun to cross the great board. The halfway point to our castle? Hmm, impressive. What was the other route? It's like there was that other way above. I wonder what I missed there. So it's a shame. I think I'm gonna backtrack and see what was up there. You won't make it a step further. Because my guys are about to smash you into blood. Lots of blood? Splooshing blood. Very... Splooshing blood. Very gross and bad. Bucket? Hey, purple girl. girl, Was that scarier? Why are you asking me? <laughs> yeah, it's a spades bucket. Yep. Yeah, we're, we're all thinking it. We're all thinking it. Oh, damn it. Why are you asking me? Because you're really cool at being terrifying. Okay, and there is actually, like... There... <laughs> Who else is starting to spade ship, uh... Susie and, uh, Lancer? <laughs> is it just me? Because this feels like... This, feel, this is starting to feel like a pitched proposition here. <laughs> uh, you're really cool at being terrifying. I want to be as scary as you. Oh, it's... 
Oh, Lancer. Lancer has a spade crest on Shoozy, and you cannot convince me otherwise. <laughs> you... You wanna be like me? <laughs> yeah! Well, that's stupid. But, um... The new laugh isn't as awful. Oh, God. And saying you turn us into blood is, a uh, cool. What the hell's up with the bucket, though? <laughs> um, it's a bit of a loaded question there, Susie. It's to put the blood in. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, uh, supposed to make a mess. Anyway, thanks for your feedback. I'm really feeling scary. Um, no problem, I guess. <laughs> Oh, Susie's making a friend. So are you guys gonna attack us, or...? Oh, yeah! I was so excited, I forgot to bring in the guys! <laughs> but next time, it'll be the end for... I've just been calling you guys clowns. Does your team have an official name or something? Oh, Chris, we should come up with a name. No, we shouldn't. <laughs> then it's decided. Everyone puts a name in the bucket. <laughs> oh. Uh, you're his role model now. Nobody's fault but your own. Deal with it. Uh, this is so... Contribute to the spade bucket, you guys. <laughs> Alright, everybody put their contributions into the spade bucket. And now the drone can come pick it up. No. <laughs> no! Too young for this. Blue person, you can choose. Since you look like you don't care. So there's the crumpled paper, which I assume is Susie's. The Lancer, the Lancer labeled, pa labeled paper, well, the neat paper. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yes. Hmm. Very difficult to tell whose is whose. Um, oh, I kind of want to pick. It's. I gotta go with the Fluffy Boy though. Okay, Fluffy Boy. What do you think we should be named? Take a neatly folded piece of paper. It's a shame there wasn't a save point anywhere near here, otherwise I totally would go back and see what the other options were. You open it up. <laughs> the legendary... The legendary heroes! The herald of fun and friendship! <laughs> oh, oh, that's mine! See? I think it's the perfect name. Because we're all friends. I like to have a lot of fun. Aww. You're so pure. So good. Okay, first... Jeez, that's a mouthful, dude. Second, what are our enemies gonna think? That we're gonna be buddies with them? Well, yeah, ideally. Let's change it to something short. Intimidating. Something punchy. Something badass. Like what? Well, uh, you know, for starters... How about just, uh... The fun gang! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> You know, just uh, concentrating on the fun part. It's perfect! Well, see ya, fun gang! I've got to... Uh, I've got to ask most my afternoon milk. Okay? So now we're the fun gang. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna save that now. That's it, it's official. We're the fun gang. The power of the fun gang shines within you. Uh, so yeah, somehow I'm gonna have to go back. I'm not gonna stream it because the last save point was like 20 minutes ago. Not like 20 minutes ago, but like... We have to go back and see what the other how that dialogue goes with the other picks. Because that was some gold right there. Um, wonder if it ends up just... Ending, I wonder if it ends up being the fun gang no matter what happens um so uh, we'll see 
You picked Susie, you could have been the shit squad. <laughs> uh, I love it. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to call it a spoiler. Like, you can go ahead and talk about it in chat, because, like, I'm not going to, like, live react to it, so it's not a spoiler, but, um, the, all the other names stick. Okay, that's good. Um, but yeah, it's like sometime I'll go back and look at how the other options go. Anyway, uh, that seems like a good place to, uh, pause part three. Um, I'm going to, uh, get some more water and, uh, continue on with part four. This is getting very fun. Very fun indeed. All right. Cut to the break. And, and I will see you all in a few moments. Bye-bye.